there you go. Molly Peterson from Hamilton Southeastern in lane number one. Barrett Berglund from Carmel, the sophomore. Uh, Peterson, by the way, is a senior. Megan Christman, sophomore from Carmel. Christina Pagel from Bloomington South is a junior. Lane number five, Emma Wright from Hobart, who's a senior. Veronica Ozimek, junior from Chesterton. Grace Brenneman, a junior from Concord. And Gracie Payne, a senior from Franklin Community High School. Lanes one through eight from the top, the bottom of your screen. You know, it may sound uh, different, but we have two returning champions in this heat, in this event. Emma Wright in 19 and Christina Christina Pagel in 2020. Now, Pagel is the only swimmer under 49 seconds. Could she make a run at that 48-36, the record by Billquist in 15? Amy Billquist set that record, as Tony said, in 2015 in the girls' 100-yard freestyle. Strong start by the field. We've noticed that our starters are, are doing a great job getting our athletes out fast in the fields. Lane number one. And that turn right there is Christina's strength. Watch her as she comes in. She'll drive that head down quick. Heels over the top. For a tall girl, she just whips those heels around. Bounces off the wall. 23-36. She's about Emma at 36 Wright. seconds here. Emma Wright from Hobart right there with her. Emma's coming on strong. She finished strong in the prelims. The 48-78, whoa. 48-78 off the record of 48-36. 49-9-3, second place finisher, Emma Wright from Hobart. And completely in the top three was Megan Crispin from Carmel with a time of 50.07. The girls' 100-yard freestyle. That 48-78, and I'm looking at our history right there. Looks like the second fastest time in history, the way I'm reading it. All right. We're going to get a good. And this is, you watch Pagel. She's a, she's a tall girl, but when she tucks and spins and that heel drives to the touch pad, she's bouncing off the wall. And that's really what she did on that first turn to give her, you separated her right off that wall from the rest of the field who mostly went in together. And here's how you finish a race strong. Boom, heels, tuck and spin. Great turn over there by Emma as well. Gave her momentum off that turn. Having a little competition also helps drive you to fast times. Now watch the head down, drive to the touch pad. Ooh, get in there fast on that finish. Twisted that hip, gave her a little bit of extension. 48-78, second fastest time in history. Christina Hegel, Bloomington South Jr. With the winning time of 48.76. I take that back third fastest. Qualified for that championship round off of 49.33. There's a look at the results. And you see that record time in the upper right-hand corner of your screen. As we mentioned, set by Amy Bilquist of Carmel with a time of 48.36. We'll be back with more of the 47th Annual Girls Swimming and Diving State Championships from the Natatorium in just a few minutes.